This video will tell you my favorite bet in Major League Baseball for Monday, April 15. First of all, congratulations to Pierre-Luc Breton, who won my free baseball prediction contest this weekend. He gets $100 US, so please contact me via email at winner at professormg.com to redeem your prize. I found it interesting that I finished in second place, as I decided to play the contest for fun. I don't believe I have ever had such a strong start to a MLB season before. So far in the 2024 campaign, I have shared 46 premium picks at mgpicks.com. The average odds have been minus 106 in American format, or 1.94 in decimal, which shows we have not just picked big favorites. Still, we have racked up an amazing 30, 12, and 4 record. If you had to risk $100 per wager, you would already be up by $1,415. And that does not even include the 11 proposition bits that are recommended, which have led to a 7 and 4 record. Let's stay hot, guys! Thank you for being part of this fun and great baseball betting journey with me. Today, my top MLB pick is as follows. Under 4.5 runs to be scored in the first 5 innings of the Reds vs Mariners match. I suggested this bet at 10.03 am Eastern Time, and at that moment, you could grab minus 128 odds with the stake sportsbook, and minus 130 with bet 99. The line has changed since then, unfortunately. At the time I recorded this video, around 10.30 am, the best line was now minus 145. You could take under 4 runs at higher odds if you prefer. I leave it up to you. Let's take a closer look at the starting pitchers, since they obviously play a large role regarding the outcome of this bet. The Reds will start Frankie Montas. The 31-year-old veteran is enjoying a good start with his new club, with a 2.16 ERA. He did not play much last year due to an injury, but in his prior two seasons, he was certainly an above-average pitcher. In fact, his whip stat stood at 1.25 and 1.18 in those years, which is better than the 1.30 league average. Meanwhile, George Kirby will take the mound for Seattle. He was extremely good last year, but he's been beaten up pretty badly so far in the 2024 season. He's given up 13 runs in 14 and one-third innings. That being said, I'm not pressing the panic button at all regarding his outlook for this year. This is just a small sample. He still has obtained 13 strikeouts versus 2 walks. I have no doubt he will rebound. It's also worth noting that his ERA was much lower at home than on the road in 2023, so he is more likely to do well tonight at T-Mobile Park. The Reds have been scoring a lot of runs this season, but I think Kirby can keep them in check. Meanwhile, the Mariners have scored the third fewest runs in the big leagues, so don't expect them to explode tonight. For all of those reasons, let's go with the under for the first half of the Cincinnati vs Seattle meeting, shall we? I wish you the best of luck with your plays, and I'll be here tomorrow to give you more betting advice. Subscribe to this betting channel hosted by a former 15-year university statistics teacher.